Another day, another story. General relativity is a theory of gravitation that was developed by Albert Einstein between 1907 and 1915. According to general relativity, the observed gravitational attraction between masses results from the warping of space and time by those masses. Before the advent of general relativity, Newton's law of universal gravitation had been sufficient to explain the forces between masses and the orbits of planets for over 200 years. Here are some key concepts and elements of general relativity. Welcome to Tabot Eminent Channel. Spacetime, general relativity introduces the concept of spacetime, which combines the three dimensions of space with the fourth dimension of time into a single four-dimensional continuum. Curvature of spacetime, general relativity posits that mass and energy can curve spacetime, and this curvature affects the motion of free particles and light. Instead of thinking of gravity as a force between masses, general relativity describes gravity as the motion of masses following the curved paths dictated by the spacetime geometry. Einstein's field equations. These are the set of equations that Einstein proposed, which relate the geometry of spacetime to the distribution of mass and energy. The equations are highly complex and typically require advanced techniques in differential geometry and tensor calculus to solve. Black holes and cosmology. General relativity predicts the existence of black holes, regions of space where the gravitational field is so strong that nothing, not even light, can escape from them. It also provides the foundational framework for the Big Bang theory of cosmology, describing how the universe has expanded from an extremely hot and dense state. Global Positioning System GPS, the accurate operation of GPS satellites and the systems that rely on them require adjustments made for both the special relativistic effects, due to the satellite's high speeds relative to the Earth's surface, and the general relativistic effects, due to the difference in gravitational potential between the Earth's surface and the altitude of the satellites. Early 20th century, a crucible for change. At the dawn of the 20th century, physics was in a state of flux. The classical view led by Newtonian mechanics could explain nearly every physical phenomenon encountered from everyday life to planetary motion. However, there were subtle yet persistent anomalies, such as the unexplained precession of the perihelion of Mercury's orbit, which Newtonian physics could not address satisfactorily. Albert Einstein, the Maverick Thinker Albert Einstein, then a relatively obscure patent clerk in Bern, Switzerland, was deeply engaged with the problems of time and space. In 1905, he published his theory of special relativity, which reconciled Maxwell's equations for electricity and magnetism with the laws of mechanics, but it applied only to frames moving at constant speeds relative to each other. Einstein knew that to incorporate acceleration and gravity, a more general theory was needed. He embarked on a quest that would last until 1915, during which he would extend the principles of special relativity into a new theory encompassing gravity. The general theory of relativity, a new framework. Einstein's key insight was to link the concept of acceleration to gravity, proposing that a person in a closed box could not tell the difference between being pulled by gravity and accelerating through space. This insight led to the principle of equivalence, central to his theory. The final form of general relativity came in November 1915 when Einstein presented his field equations to the Prussian Academy of Sciences. These equations described how matter and energy affect the curvature of space-time and, conversely, how this curvature directs the movement of matter and energy. Empirical Tests – Confronting Reality The true test of any scientific theory is its confrontation with empirical data. For general relativity, this came with several key observations. 1919 Solar Eclipse The British physicist Sir Arthur Eddington organized expeditions to observe the solar eclipse from Brazil and the island of Principe off West Africa. The photographs taken confirmed Einstein's prediction that the light from stars passing close to the sun would be bent by the sun's gravity. This bending was more than twice what would have been predicted by Newtonian theory and matched Einstein's calculations precisely. The expanding universe. In the 1920s, observations by astronomers like Edwin Hubble showed that distant galaxies are moving away from us in all directions, suggesting that the universe is expanding. This was a direct implication of Einstein's equations, although initially even Einstein did not fully accept the idea. 
legacy and ongoing impact. The confirmation of general relativity not only catapulted Einstein to international fame but also transformed our understanding of the universe. It laid the groundwork for the study of black holes and the Big Bang and continues to be essential in the age of GPS technology and the exploration of gravitational waves. The Quantum Challenge The story of general relativity is a testament to the creativity and persistence of the human spirit. It shows how daring to reimagine the fundamental fabric of reality can lead to profound insights and technologies that transform our everyday lives. This ongoing story is not just about uncovering the universe's secrets but also about the relentless human pursuit of understanding. Albert Einstein began working on the theory of general relativity around 1907, shortly after he had completed his special theory of relativity, which dealt with the behavior of objects moving at constant speeds in the absence of gravitational forces. In his quest to extend his theory to include gravity, Einstein encountered numerous challenges and setbacks. One of the primary difficulties was reconciling his new theory with the well-established framework of Newtonian gravity, which had been incredibly successful for centuries. Einstein's breakthrough came from a series of thought experiments and conceptual leaps rather than traditional mathematical derivations. He realized that rather than considering gravity as a force acting at a distance, he could interpret it as the curvature of spacetime caused by mass and energy. This insight led him to develop the field equations of general relativity, which relate the curvature of spacetime to the distribution of matter and energy within it. The mathematical formalism required to express general relativity was highly complex, involving sophisticated concepts from differential geometry and tensor calculus. Einstein himself struggled with the mathematics, often collaborating with mathematicians such as Marcel Grossman to refine his equations. By 1915, Einstein had formulated the final version of his field equations. However, their implications were so radical that even Einstein himself was initially hesitant to fully embrace them. One of the first major tests of general relativity came in 1919 during a solar eclipse, when astronomers observed the bending of starlight passing near the Sun, confirming one of the theory's predictions. Despite its successes, general relativity also raised new questions and challenges, particularly in the realm of quantum mechanics. The search for a theory of quantum gravity, which would unite general relativity with the principles of quantum mechanics, remains one of the most significant endeavors in theoretical physics today. In summary, the story of general relativity is not just a tale of scientific discovery but also one of perseverance, intellectual courage, and the transformative power of ideas. Thanks for watching request you to subscribe the channel.